Hi guys, Bob Razzuri, Orange County, California. I have a few words about API CPD hours, which means continuing professional development hours. Starting January 1st, 2023, you need some CPD hours to renew your API 510, API 570, and API 653 certifications. The details of the requirement are available on API Individual Certification Program website. There is a PDF file of 22 pages. You can download and review the details of the CPD hours requirements. The summary is that you need eight hours of a training course credit if your cert expires in 2023, 16 hours if your cert expires in 2024, and 24 hours if your cert expires in 2025. The key point is that the training courses shall be related to your certification. Generally, the welding, coding, asset integrity, corrosion, and related codes and standards courses are acceptable. However, the courses you take shall have a final exam at the end, and you shall receive a passing score. The courses that do not offer a final exam at the end will not be accepted by API as a CPD hours. If you need CPD hours to renew your API 510, API 570, and API 653, look at the I4I Academy website. We have several affordable online training courses that you can take. All our training courses have the timed final exams and are acceptable to the API. These training courses included video sessions, almost 500 practice questions, and a final exam. The system generates a certificate indicating your CPD hours earned when you pass the exam. Our ASME training course, API 571 training course, ASME Section 9 course, API SIFE course are affordable and best options for API CPD hours. By the way, if between 2020 and 2023 you have taken any of our courses and participated in the final exam, a copy of your certificate is in our database. You can contact us to get your copy and submit it to the API. Check out links below and do not hesitate to contact us if you have any questions. Thank you.